Hey everyone, Creative Venus here, and today we will create this custom resolution slide of 2960 by 1440, which is especially uh, perfect fit for devices like Galaxy Note 9. So, first of all, we have to change the resolution by going into design, slide size, and type 2960px in the width column and in the height type 1440px and it will automatically convert it into the centimeters then you have to click on maximize and then click on next and you are done now let's start with the design part here first of all insert a right triangle here and you have to place it on the left side of the slide so I assume that it is pretty easy to draw a triangle. You just have to fit uh, and match the height of the slide and remove the shape outline. And now the next step is we will fill pattern here. So I'm kind of experimenting here what pattern will look good. So. Let's try this one. We will try to keep it of like dark gray color and so let's try this one and this pattern looks good but we have to adjust the colors and you have to select here background and foreground color so I'm just testing here gray color here for background and foreground now let's fill black gradient in the background as well for that you can try linear or radial I prefer radial background so I have used two stop gradient in the background now our first triangle is done now let's insert another triangle and place it as you are seeing on your screen right now so you, you have to make sure it is perfectly aligned and again we have filled the same pattern and but this time we will apply shadow effect on this triangle and just increase the blurness and distance so that the shadow is visible but pattern on both these triangles are similar so let's change the pattern a bit now i'm just testing few patterns here uh, i think this pattern will look good here yes it is looking perfectly fine now our two triangles are ready and background is also ready now let's fit in the third triangle here today we will play with the triangles only and I'm inspired by the material design by Google so I've seen such designs where triangle is very important so I'm creating this design inspired by the material design of Google you can search material design Google uh, this time we will not fill the pattern in this uh, triangle here we will apply a dark gray color which is close to black and apply the shadow effect just adjust the blurness and distance and you will get a nice shadow on this triangle now it's the time to insert the fourth triangle so you have to duplicate the same triangle and reduce its height and give it a more darker gray color which is almost black so I'm just aligning these two triangles now duplicate the second triangle and reduce its height and you'll get your third triangle and we have to apply some gray dark gray color which is lighter than second triangle and let's try to fill gradient color in the second triangle because it is in the middle and we want to make it look more realistic like light is 
falling on this triangle so we have to give that kind of effect uh, for that uh, matter the gradient the gradient option looks better than the solid fill so now you can see it is looking more 3d and more realistic so it's all about experimenting with different things so just keep on experimenting until you will get the until you get the desired results so i think our left side is almost ready again duplicate the pattern triangle and rotate it vertically and we will place it in the background so we will send it to back for that you have to right click and send to back but before that we will apply the shadow effect again adjust the shadow parameters here and your triangle is ready just send it to back and i think it is ready so our shape is ready here let's slightly change the color of the uh, triangle in the background which has a pattern fill so that it looks more realistic now so now it is looking perfectly fine i am pretty much satisfied with this design at the moment now let's move towards the right side of the slide area so you have to copy that triangle the black one and let's place it on the right side of the slide just expand it a bit apply gradient color and you can create your own custom gradient which is a mixture of black and a dark gray and let's place it at the bottom right uh, apply a shadow effect here adjust the blurness and distance so now the shadow is visible so it is looking more beautiful now and let's increase its size and we will remove this extra portion of the triangle by placing a rectangle above it and let's subtract it and you get the desired shape now what should we do is again duplicate the triangle from the left flip horizontally and vertically let's place it on the bottom right and match the width of the previous triangle which is below it and let's try to fill linear gradient let's pick some angle so you can adjust the angle as per your choice it's totally uh, you know uh, it's totally your decision and you can take your call so I am pretty much satisfied with the current design at the moment so our shapes are almost ready now let's try to fill some pattern shape here so we have duplicated the shape from the left side of the slide and pasted it on the right side just send it to back and I think we should keep in the middle of these two black triangles so it gives a nice revealing effect like this triangle is slightly visible between these two dark triangles now we have again duplicated the triangle with the pattern from the left side of the slide and placed it on the right side let's decrease its height and expand its width and set it to back so here we have very beautiful slide ready and look at the width it's 2960 and it will look more beautiful on 
new age smartphones with the resolution of 2960 by 1440 so now it's the time to add some text here some branding so you are completely free to try anything here it's your own creativity to write any text in any form so i'm writing creativeness so place it in the center and now let's duplicate it and we will write a subheading and i have used oswald font here which i have downloaded from google fonts now i have duplicated the title to write subheading so i have written business presentations and again oswald light so here you can try and test different things you can place text horizontally vertically anything you want so i'm sure you will find this tutorial very very easy because uh, it's just a collection of some triangles so let's count how, how many triangles we have used uh, one two three four five six six triangles on the left side and one two three four and four on the right so in total we have used 10 triangles out of which five have pattern and three have solid fills and two have gradient fill so yeah it is very easy to create with just 10 triangles a beautiful slide you don't need any specific tool to create a beautiful graphic to make your slide look beautiful it's all about being creative and think of something which is very new also you can get some inspiration so i i have seen similar kind of designs and that's why i thought of this concept so i have created the slide by keeping those inspiration inspirational designs in mind so coming back to the tutorial uh, i've also added some dummy text here now let's do something creative here which i love the most so we will write the text in a very large font here big font size so let's write business in oswald semi bold font and i don't think black color is looking good here so first of all let's change its color to something like i think we should keep it white and increase the transparency that will give it much more natural color yes i was right now send it to back so now it's revealing itself and this kind of uh this kind of you know uh, text concept will certainly catch the attention of the user so let's duplicate it and write presentation but reduce its font size make it small and place it towards the right side of the slide at the bottom so let's align it and set it to back here i think it will look good also in this increase the transparency so that it is visible but not too much so our slide design is complete now as you can see on the screen so i hope you like the design of this slide so please like hit the like button and also subscribe to our channel Please do not forget to hit the bell icon as well and this will motivate us. So thanks for watching and have a very nice day. Bye bye.